previously on LEGO Marvel Super Heroes. Hey, it's Thor. Nice. I sense the opening of the Vortex because Brother Loki used it as a pathway to Asgard. One thing. Power. We're going into the sky anus. Better than any roller coaster! Remain vigilant! I would have to disagree with you there, Johnny, because this is virtual and roller coasters are real. And roller coasters also suck ass. Punk. Why did that make a rooster noise? Now, gentlemen, let us go to the stratosphere. Or not. Johnny. Ah. Uh, no. Torch. Okay. I'm like, why was he just stuck in the corner? And now we take 17 light years to jump up these flowers because I don't know how to play games, apparently. I intend to get my revenge on you, on Earth, and on Asgard. Do you remember this little plaything? Oh no, the destroyer. Please, I- This glow cube can help me find Magneto. I can ask Chuck about that. Figure this can help us find Magneto. The thing I think it will find for us is unwanted attention. Yo, what's going on everybody, and welcome back to some more LEGO Marvel Super Heroes. As you saw last time, there has been a gigantic explosion at the X-Mansion. So, using, actually, a couple of my favorite X-Men characters, we're gonna go stop it. But particularly with Cyclops, because he's my actual favorite. Him and Beast, for some reason. Get a lot of flack for having Cyclops as my favorite. And turn those sprinklers on. It's no good. He can't hear you through his own deafening screams. That's awesome. Okay, just burned myself somehow. Don't know how that happened. Ooh, studs! Scott, you seem to have the running ability. Thanks. I was nearly so get this. Burnt get all of the studs. Why does Cyclops run this fast? Good lord, Scott. Sheesh. Well, most of them disappeared, so I need Jean. You know, this actually doesn't look too far off from the current Cyclops figure that LEGO released that I still have yet to get my hands on. I will eventually. But without my yapping continuing, Let's get on with the mission. Come on, we need to rescue the students. Cyclops, Jean, you need to rescue any trapped students. I sense he's in danger. Do not worry about me. I am safe in the Cerebro Chamber, with an object of great power called the Tesseract. Open the emergency escape tunnels to lead the students to safety. Just let me steal all of your money real quick, Charles. Find and open them quickly. This picture up here is pretty cool. Oh, hey, Beast is there too. I only really noticed... I really only noticed Angel, Iceman, the Professor, Cyclops, and Jean. I didn't notice Beast chilling in the right corner. Hey, 
Hey, there's Deadpool. <laughs> Just chilling up there. Jeez, Scott. You should be able to move it's kind of ruthless. Is he going to cut an X into this? Yep. Cutting X's into walls now. Whoopsies. Oops. I keep firing my eye beams when I don't mean to. on the ground. Go away. Random people. If I remember correctly, these are Magneto's Acolytes. What the hell? No, that's unacceptable. I should probably help Jean. Because she might die. Also, I want to throw in a side note here, because they don't do it in this game, but I think it's really funny. The joke in X-Men media of when anyone screams Jean Grey's name is hilarious to me. I remember I was watching X-Men Evolution once and Scott screamed Jean and I just died laughing so hard. Oh, I wasn't even supposed to do that. What the hell? Can't even destroy that door. Where the hell am I supposed to go? Ah, stuck in a flower pot. Cyclops is one weakness, a flower pot. It's not Deadpool that killed the Marvel Universe. It was a damn flower pot. Alright, Gene, and then you pull the lever. I like how everybody else in this game gets, like, actual... <laughs> Go in there, Cyclops. Jeez. Whoa, Juggernaut. I thought he was gonna say I'm the Juggernaut, bitch, like he does in X Men 3. That'd have been so funny. Just, I'm the Juggernaut, bitch! But no, I, I like that. I think it's funny that everybody in, like, all the X-Men characters in this game get their, like, superhero names, like, you know, Archangel and Cyclops and Beast and Professor X, and then you just have Jean. She doesn't get Marvel Girl. She just gets Jean Grey. Although she technically does have her Phoenix identity in this game. He's around here somewhere. So, uh, yeah, I guess that's one reason they didn't call her Phoenix. Holy... Crap, Juggernaut. Jeez, Kane. I knew you had anger issues. But I didn't know they were that severe. Jean Grey. Oh, I'm supposed to mind control someone? Ouch. Unless I run into fire. I want to make up for last video, where I didn't get a ton of studs. How the hell was I getting studs from there? Guessing it was something through that door. What the hell? Mind control this guy. I hate how slow he goes. Not even jumping helps him go faster. Uh, thank you very much, random dude. I don't know what accent that was destroy this random student's bed. That person's gonna come back to the mansion after it's all rebuilt. They're gonna come back to the their bedroom and be like, who the hell destroyed my bed? <laughs> These damn X-Men keep destroying my bed and jumping on people like a game of whack-a-mole. That was brutal. Just look at this mess. We need to get through. 
Yeah, leave that to me. Where's Iceman when you need him? Use him to put out all this freaking fire. But I have a feeling we're about to meet a different X-Men. Storm, are you alright? Every time I see Storm with Toad, I just think of that one line from X-Men 1. You know the one. If you've seen the movie, you know the line I'm talking about. I'm not gonna recite it because it's so stupid. But I just think of that one scene every time I see Toad and Storm in an X-Men thing. You put the chair up. Alright. Where's the others? That's cool. She could fire little tornadoes. Does allow door close. Okay, well, I did not mean to do that. Oh shoot, I have to move these ones too. Probably all I have to do, right? And the center of it opens? And some stuff comes out? Yep. For Storm. Whoops. No, don't fire tornadoes. Oh, it's a hole in the table. Where do you think that leads? The danger room? I hope so. Because I want to go to the danger room. It seems like fun. Hello. Come in, <gasps> Beast! Beast, we read you. What's your situation? No time to explain. I've locked the school down so the doors won't open. Ouch. Okay, that was a cheap shot. You die now. Where's Havoc? That's what I want to know. What the hell? Oh, no, I'm supposed to use Gene's mind abilities to pull that out the wall. Yeah, there we go. And I'm assuming that this one is a free play one. Like this explosive one is a free play one, I would guess. Because there's a magneto puzzle right next to it. Quite fitting, honestly. Telekinesis. I've always liked that word. Cool. Oh yeah, I can see a very striking silhouette in this guy. It's Angel, or Archangel. I don't know. Like I said, I don't read X-Men. I might start here soon, though. Because of, you know, recent news with Deadpool. But, I don't know if it's Angel or Archangel. I've heard it said both ways across X-Men media. So I honestly don't know. If any of you do know, leave it in the comments and educate me. What the hell? How do you get up there? Oh, you go down here. Bobby, no. Pyro! Hot enough for you, Bobby? This isn't cool! <laughs> oh, the ice puns. Alright, Pyro. Let's end this. Sorry I gotta be so cold with you, buddy. You kinda stole my joke there, Iceman, but that's okay. If I did not like you as an X-Man, I would- Colossus! I forgot he was here. The Juggernaut. Watch out! Nothing can stop the Juggernaut. So why is Colossus even trying? Wait a second. <gasps> That's just like in Deadpool 2 when they fighted. How about you 
using that. Except less, like, dark. Although people are getting broken to pieces, so you could argue it might be on the same level of darkness as Deadpool 2. You're not even focused on the ice, moron. Let me see, can I save Stan? I don't think I can. Can I? It'd be awesome if I could. No, I need a big fig for that. Okay. Well, anyways. Time to freeze stuff. Cyclops, where are you at, bro? Getting stuck in wood, <laughs> in wood planks, apparently. Nice. Bobby, we need you again. That doesn't sound like Juggernaut and Colossus are fighting. <laughs> it sounds like something much more sinister. Hello, Bobby. That was a gnarly voice crack. Good lord. I was wondering what was taking you so long to freeze that, Iceman. Now, oh, if only we had Wolverine. Why did you automatically go to beat up Storm? Excuse me? I'm not even playing as Storm. Ow. Yeesh. Want to just deface Charles Xavier's property. Because Iceman seems like the type of guy who would do that. Oh, I can't break that. Lame. Ah. Break this Cyclops. Yeah, I gotta get around to getting the minifigure of this guy. This one and the Astonishing X-Men one. must rescue them. I don't remember when that came out, but it looks like a cool figure. Ooh, the bookshelf. Telekinesis power. Actually, no, we'll play as Gene. Fuck some people up as Gene Gray. Did not mean to swear just then, but I'm not gonna censor it, so. You don't like a deal with it. Is that girl gonna jump? I seriously wonder where that goes. I'm afraid your attempts to stop me are too late. Failure to hand over the Tesseract will result in the destruction of your precious home. I'm pretty sure it's been destroyed before and been rebuilt, so I don't think this is much of an issue for the X-Men. Yes, but why would I hover across a fire a storm when I have Iceman who can just freeze a fire and put it out? Storm, go on the platform. Female power. Whoops. Not Scott. Not Bobby. Storm. No. God damn it. Storm! God damn it. Oh my hell. Thank you. Now it's not- okay, I was like, now it's not gonna switch to Jean Grey. Uh, I'm stuck in a wall. Oh, Gene can hover. Forgot about that. Come on. Come on. I don't care. Just get on the damn thing. Holy crap, that was more... Why'd you make that more difficult than it needed to be, Gene? I say that like it was her fault. That was very clearly my fault. Oops. Uh-oh. 
I might have just screwed up. Can I get back? Yes. That's why Iceman is cool. Pardon the pun. Gambit, I think. Holy crap, Gambit just got messed up by the juggernaut. The students are safe. You must stop Magneto. We can't keep up. There has to be a quicker route to head him off. Head for the fireplace. We can use the secret passage. To where? Are we going to a danger room? Probably not. I just think the danger room is cool. Hey, it's... I don't know who this is. But she wasn't here before. I know that for a fact. Yeah, Gambit. Fuck him up, Gambit. How did his helmet not come off? Uh-oh. <laughs> I love the way Juggernaut runs. It's so funny. The way Juggernaut runs is hilarious. It's like when Ted runs in the in the Ted movies and the Ted show. That run makes me laugh every single time I see it. Holy hell. Hey, uh, guys, I'm gonna continue the mission without you. Is that Yuri Lowenthal playing Iceman? That would be very funny if it was. Ouch. Can we go down this hallway and save Gambit? No, we can't save Gambit. Deadpool's gone from the balcony. Night number one. And night number two. Now, Jean Grey, do your thing. Uh, no, this has the red flag, so it goes here. This one, I fucked up by dropping it. Okay, everybody jump off the balcony before you get absolutely shat on like that. I was gonna say before you get absolutely shat on by Magneto Acolytes, but I already, I did that as soon as I switched to freaking Storm. Boom! Now oh, her lightning attack isn't as powerful. Our enemy shall take the full force of the elements. That was very aggressive, Storm. I like it. To the danger room, fellas and fellaettes. Okay, screw that with a wrench. Oh, it's Cerebro, not the danger room. Professor X has agreed to let me care for the. It's Mystique. It's not Professor X. It's Mystique. Of course, he knows I'm good with technology. And he knows you'll double cross him at the drop of your helmet. <laughs> yep, knew it. There's no way to treat a lady, Summers. <laughs> Make sure the children are protected. I'll take care of these two. Yay, beast. No running in the hallway, please. <laughs> How many times must I say it? No running in the hallways! Oh. <laughs> Beast is like, oh shit. Beautiful, isn't it? Magneto! <laughs> we 
You seem to have upset the natives. Deal with them. Don't you know who I am? I'm the Yeah, yeah, we get it. Oh my stars. We have our hands. Oh my stars. Beast. Nobody says oh my stars. Now we need Gene for this. Ah! Oh, I almost didn't do that. Hey, who put out the light? Me. You asshole. Whoa. I can't see a thing. Good. That's the idea. Oh my gosh. That Magneto Acolyte was almost me. I almost got skewered by the Juggernaut. I almost got, I'm the Juggernaut bitched. Freeze it. Uh, not freeze beast. What the hell? Yeah, I was like. I think you need to chill out a little. Freeze juggernaut, not beast. Bell? What the fuck is your problem? Okay. I apologize for that, audience. I had some things going on I had to attend to but I am back and I am ready to kick the juggernauts ass or fail in that case come on rip him in half no oh. you're not fun Gene oh what the freaking hell why is that so hard to do Ooh! Oh, I almost failed that. Almost failed that. Miserably. Nice man. I need you for the file. How to freaking file. Ooh! I really thought he was gonna come at me just there. Whoa! Yeah, like that. He just completely mowed down beast. Come on, Hank. Oh! Shit. We're just getting owned by Magneto folk. Okay. Well, you know what? Jean can't. Oh, she can. I did not know she had a ranged attack. Not really all that effective. I think Cyclops would be a better bet to have. Because at least Cyclops could. You know, guarantee they're down. Oh, whatever. Let's get some studs before the level ends. Whoa! Scared the daylights out of me. Ow! Okay, I gotta stop running directly into him. You know what? We'll continue. Maybe we'll get studs. Or get Gene rammed into by the Juggernaut? That sounded a lot more sexual than I meant for it. Have some of this. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't help but laugh every time the Juggernaut runs. What is Hank doing? Is he mixing chemicals? Hank, are you making drugs? Be honest. Are you making drugs, Hank? He's not gonna respond. So I'm gonna take that as an indication that Hank McCoy is indeed making drugs. Who can, who can use that? Beast? Oh, no, I have to get the helmet off. I have to get the helmet off of Juggernaut. I 
has to get the helmet off a of juggernaut and then mind control him to make him use it if I remember correctly. Ooh. Boost ya! Come on, I gotta get more. I need more! So I can finish the game on True Believer! I was gonna say, but there are no blue studs. But yes, there is. There is more. I wonder if I destroy those things. Those little telekinesis things, if I'll get studs. I'll have to see. I'll have to see about doing that. And if it gets me studs, not you. Eugene. It does give me studs. Very little, but it gets me studs. Ugh. Come on. I need you to drop, Gene. Thank you. Oh, I could destroy this stuff. Maybe. Yes! There we go. Holy hell, that was very loud. Forgot to turn the volumes down on my headphones. Oh, uh... Go forward. Go left. And go back up. If it works. If it works. There we go. He got grabbed like Buzz Lightyear in Toy Story. No! Oh, help me! What have you done? Fascinating. Your mind is a blank page, Juggernaut. Now I shall write on it. Thank you for interrupting me, Gene. Ah! Charles. For those that don't know, Juggernaut is the brother of Charles Xavier. That's why he just said, Gal, my head, Charles. I'm sure most of you watching this video probably know that. But just in case you didn't, there's that little factoid of information. I'm not gonna fight these guys. Because I don't need to. All I need to do is just rip this thing off the freaking wall. What are you slug to a tree? Trying to achieve you being frozen in a block of ice and then dumped in the Atlantic Ocean, Juggernaut. That's what I'm trying. You get the hell away from me. For I am Iceman! Maybe. If I could freeze Juggernaut. Here we go. And sayonara, Jugsy. <laughs> that was like a family guy fall. I didn't laugh that hard until Hank said what he said. That was also very funny. That is most unfortunate. I think that means we'll owe Nick Fury a few favors. Okay, one lock storm. I was gonna say Cyclops, but we already unlocked Cyclops last time. Beast, nice. Iceman, yeah. The Juggernaut, bitch. And Pyro. Who I know nothing about outside of X-Men 2 and 3. Almost at a million, baby, let's go. He shot Ben with a fireball. Shield at the time. Besides, I can expense it. But there's something else I need you to help me with. Magneto has stolen the Tesseract and we've tracked its energy signature to Latveria. It's finally time for Operation Latveria to get underway. Why'd it take so long to plan? Approvals, counter signatures, four rounds of notes. 
<laughs> if Doom combines the power of the Tesseract with those cosmic bricks, it could be very dangerous. He has to be stopped. Yeah, it's that. No, not yet. Are you going to tell them, sir? One threat at a time, Coulson. Oh, please tell me we get to play as the thing. There's no dialogue here, even though I feel like there should be. Visible woman. Seriously, you guys? How are you planning on? No, we can't play as the thing. Fantastic of course. Let me play as Ben. Oh well, we will have to worry about that next time, as I'm actually going Hello, to Fantastic jack this Ford. car. You're needed in Latveria right away. Fantastic car should get you there quickly enough. Yeah, 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 we'll have to worry about finding the Fantastic car next time, because I'm gonna end the video there, so if you enjoyed it, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe, as that really, really helps me out a ton, and I really, really appreciate it. I hope you have an amazing, 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 amazing day or night, and I'll catch you on the flip side.